Hey guys, BF Viking here. Hope you're all having an awesome day so far, and today I've got some exciting news that the DICE devs have given us about the bugs and glitches in the Battlefield 1 beta. So this article is written by one of the lead devs at DICE, which gives us some insight on how the devs have responded to our feedback, so I'm just going to read out some of the important parts of this article. Well, first off, I'd like to talk to you about the Conquest game mode. When we build a new Battlefield game, it's important for us to try new things. We want to stay fresh and renew the franchise with each installment. However, it's equally important that we take the feedback that you, the community, are giving us, and that is why we're going to be making changes to the Conquest game mode ticket system for launch. The next time you play the game, capturing objectives and getting kills will both contribute towards the final score of a Conquest match. You have spoken and we have listened. We've also been monitoring and listening to your comments in regards to the Rush game mode. It is super exciting for us to bring back Rush to Battlefield 1, and we are aiming to make it the best Rush experience to date. We are also making tweaks to the game modes as we speak with your feedback as the backbone to the entire process. So it looks like we're going to be seeing Conquest we all know and love in Battlefield 1. They haven't gave us much information in this post, but I'm quite sure some things will be different to keep the franchise fresh. He also states, We're also looking into balancing other elements, including the weapons and vehicles, the light tank, which is a bit too effective in the open beta, will definitely be receiving some work, and we can agree that horses can take a few too many rounds at the moment. We've also learned through the beta that you guys need more tools to deal with vehicles earlier, which we'll definitely look into, including a gadget for the support class, which should, which should help neutralize powerful vehicles. So thankfully the light tank will be receiving a nerf, which is definitely needed, and I'm quite sure that we're all very happy about this. The horses will also be getting nerfed, those things were freaking invincible, so there is another change for the better. There will also be a new gadget for the support class, two counter tanks. Not quite sure what this is going to be, but we're just going to have to wait and see here. I won't be surprised if the assault's anti-tank weaponry will be getting buffed as well. So everyone, that just about sums it up for this Battlefield News video. It's so exciting knowing that Battlefield 1 is less than a month away. That's absolutely insane how time goes. So it's just going to be such an amazing Battlefield seeing that the devs are listening to us. We know for sure that the launch will be quite smooth and that they are willing to change certain aspects of the game for our liking. Anyways guys, enough of my rambling. If you enjoyed, it would be greatly appreciated if you put a like on the video and subscribe. If you'd like to see much more Battlefield news and just more Battlefield content in general. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope you're having an awesome day and I'll see you all in the next Battlefield video.